So you may have heard um, in ESL research the two terms, bottom-up strategies and top-down strategies. I'm just going to quickly talk about the difference between the two because that is a question that seems to surface quite a bit. Um, top-down strategies are things like guessing the meaning of, of unknown words from context or previewing before you read and trying to predict what this passage is going to be about that you're going to read. Um, Top-down strategies utilize um, a wide range of uh, background experience, um, context, um, information that students have gained from experience, from um, real world um, contexts. So students are, are able to um, to use what they know and they're able to use these higher level cognitive thinking skills to help comprehend what they're reading. Um, Bottom-up strategies on the other hand are skills that are um, that are that require a, a little less um, mind power. Um, they they take a letter, uh, uh, they take letters and, and see how a word is formed using these letters. Um, so you think on the, the word level, syllable level, word level, sentence level. Um, basically it's, it's things like decoding, um, breaking down words, um, spelling words letter by letter, um, and things like that where they're, they're, they're looking at the smaller pieces. Um, of text and then building up that way. Um, both top-down and bottom-up strategies are important. Generally how it works is as we read and, and we are trying to comprehend a text, we use our top-down strategies and then when we come across a word that's unfamiliar, we will use bottom-up strategies to decode the word, to generate meaning, meaning that way, and then we continue reading. Um, so both top-down and bottom-up strategies are very important in reading and when we use both of those types of strategies together we call it interactive reading and so we want to help our ESL students um, to master top-down strategies of course but we don't want to neglect those bottom-up strategies either because when students are reading they're they're likely going to encounter words that are unfamiliar because they're reading words that are not in their foreign in their native language, um, and so we want to be able to help them learn how to use these bottom-up strategies to help them with their vocabulary development, um, which will help them with their comprehension as well.